Need a cure for insomnia? <sighs> Let me read you the history of the development of Liyue's legal system. None of my friends have ever lasted longer than 20 minutes. The other new playable character in version 1.5 is Yenfei, a legal advisor active in Liyue Harbor. She's a catalyst wielder and holds a pyrovision. Interestingly enough, she happens to be part illuminated beast. Oh, just like Ganyu. Exactly. So are those two sticks on her head her version of horns, or are they more like antlers? Wait, I thought those were her pigtails, no? No. No, Zach, not at all. Oh. No, those <laughs> are the symbol of her illuminated beast heritage. Okay, so question. Would that mean she knows Rex Lapis then, or would she be bound by a contract with Morax in some way? You mean like as a legal advisor for the God of Contracts? That would be quite the big title, but yeah, something like that? Even Morax doesn't have command of all the Illuminated Beasts. Yenfei is one of the few that didn't sign a contract with him. Oh, why is that? She was born in a peaceful era. Therefore, there was no need for her to fight in any cruel wars like her predecessors. Interestingly, as a free Illuminated Beast, she's put herself in a profession where her job is to interpret laws and help others deal with conflicts and disputes. Okay, so her work is all related to contracts, right? Because I know I saw some sort of gigantic pyro stamp slamming down when she attacks. You know, like the kind of thing you'd see used to stamp a contract? Mm-hmm. You are correct. Both her normal attack, her elemental skill signed edict, and her elemental burst done deal grant her scarlet seals, which decrease Yen Fei's stamina consumption. But these scarlet seals are not the big seal you saw. Oh, so the Scarlet Seals must have been all those little red markings floating around her. That's right. When she uses her charged attack, Yenfei consumes all Scarlet Seals, which in turn increase her charged attack's area of effect and damage. Oh, so that's what I saw. It sure was. Oh, uh, one thing uh, I forgot to mention is that Yula and Yenfei have some special connections to one another. Uh, what would a knight in Mondstadt have to do with a legal advisor in Liyue Harbor? Sounds like a mystery. Yes, indeed. One which the travelers will get to discover on their own. Leave it to me. Um, rude. Leave it to us. Oh, yeah. Right. Uh, us. Uh, right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you too. And that's all the latest we have on the new characters. Wait a minute. Didn't you forget something? Uh, I don't think so. You know, I, I have a pretty good memory, Zach. <laughs> Zach was going to ask where we'll get to pull these adorable new characters from, right? Yeah. Oh, we'll, we'll get to that all, all in good time. Right now seems to be a good time for us to give away our first redemption code. Oh, now? <laughs> like I said, you never know when they'll appear. Precisely. The first code will be unearthed in three, two, one.